Hello. Thank you for joining for MicroStrategy demo. Next that we're going to discuss is about the MicroStrategy administration. We understand that you know we need to does uh, we need to architect the MicroStrategy. We need to create uh, various kind of a, de a de development within the MicroStrategy tool. But even MicroStrategy offers various administrative tools where you can you know perform all the administrative tasks monitoring, automation, and so on. So as a MicroStrategy administrator, you're going to be responsible for tuning, monitoring, and troubleshooting your MicroStrategy BI system. It also offers the user security so that a right data is available for the right user. It even ha uh, has the user authentication. So it's not that MicroStrategy is available for everyone. As a user, when you try to access the MicroStrategy, you have to authenticate yourself. And once the authentication is successful, you can access the data within it. So that it has a system which will be identifying the user. It also has, offers the secure communication. It encodes the communication over internet or local network. You have to be managing the licenses and the project. And finally, you need to make sure you have all your reports. MicroStrategy offers various administrative tools or the components through which you can perform various administrative tasks. The first that we have is the system manager. A system manager is something where you can combine multiple sequential processes for MicroStrategy environment into a single workflow that can be deployed at a scheduled time or on demand. So you can perform, like you can create a workflow which will perform a step by step all the processes, like whatever the task that you want to perform. And based on that, it could be scheduled either a time based or an on demand. So if in case you want to have that, okay, first I need to see my server is running or not. Thereafter, I need to make sure my report gets executed. As a third step, it has to get distributed to all the multiple users and so on. So if in case you want to perform a sequential step-by-step -step processes, you can always have that created in the system manager. The, once your workflow has been created, you can have this thing trigger at a specific uh, time or you can even say, you can even trigger it on demand. A second tool that we have is the command manager. Even the, within the, uh, from the command manager, you can perform various administrative and application development tasks by using the text command that can be saved as a script. So whatever the objects you create, you can even, you know, that okay, from the development perspective, you can go to the desktop or a developer, you can create all the objects, you can maintain all the administration uh, users and everything. There's something also uh, where you can write the scripts and you can just execute the scripts, a certain functionality will be performed. So if in case I want to create the bulk, a chunk of users, like I'd say 100 users, I really don't have to right click 100 times and say create new user. But instead, I can just create a script which when I run it via command manager, all the 100 users will be created within few seconds. So you can, pre, uh, you, can all, you can always perform various administrative and the application development tasks by using the such uh, scripts. So it, it has, the command manager has all the commands where you can you know, perform all this administrative and the development tasks. There's something also MicroStrategy has is called as integrity manager. An uh, integrity manager allows the automated comparison tool they are designed to streamline the testing of reports and documents in projects. So if in case you have a multiple environment of your MicroStrategy, let's say the development environment and the testing environment, Integrity Manager will always help you to compare your report data, report SQL, and so on. So it's not that you know you manually have to run all the reports to make sure your uh, the, data, the report are, uh, are in sync across the environment, no. You can always make you can always make use of integrity manager, which you just have to select some parameters, and it's going to do all the comparison automatically. We even have something called as the enterprise manager. Enterprise manager provides insights about governing and tuning by analyzing by analyzing the usage statistics collected by intelligent server. So whatever the activity that has been performed on a server. All those statistics are collected 
by this thing and on top of that you can do your reporting so which user has accessed the Microsoft strategy and my message are the reports which are taking longer time uh, which which is the report which is hit it very frequently so whatever the statistical information you really want to uh, fetch it out you can always uh, you know access it via enterprise manager we even something have called as health center which will be helpful to prevent diagnose and fix the problems in the system as we said that you can have the micro strategy across multiple environments and whenever you uh, all the development of course going to be happening in the dev environment and when you when you want to migrate all those objects across the environment you can always use the object manager object manager is something which will be helpful for migrating migrating the objects across various environments it even has the narrowcast administration so whatever the scheduling of your reports and documents you want to do and you know either you want to uh, email it out save at some location update the cache for various formats like excel pdf flash and so on all these things can be handled via narrowcast administration and the last thing that we have is the micro strategy office integrating micro strategy in microsoft tools like excel word and powerpoint so you have your microsoft tools and from there as well you can just integrate your uh, integrate with your micro strategy environment so if you take an example over here i can create a presentation which can directly access the reports and uh, you can represent it in form of various uh, grids and the graphs so every time i do not have to update my powerpoint whenever i just refresh it it's going to access the micro strategy from there it's going to pick up the updated data and that can be represented in powerpoint so it's a one time effort and whenever at any point of time after six months after a year whenever i access the powerpoint i will always have the updated information from the data warehouse so this is all about the micro strategy administration thanks a lot for joining in